We got our ingredients here. We got our hot dogs. We got our pasta shells. The only ingredient that I don't see here is the adult diaper you're gonna need to wear after consuming this. Take your dog, put it in your shell. Now you wanna slide it in ever so gently. I just wanna apologize, Grandma. I am sorry that I am doing this to manicotti shells. <laughs> Welcome back to Celebrity Sleepover and the room where I do my best work, the kitchen. Ever have one of those nights where you're aimlessly scrolling through your phone, totally relaxed, and you start falling down a food trends rabbit hole, and then bam, just like that, you're famished and wondering to yourself, is that recipe legit? Tonight, we're making a few of those viral recipes so I can determine just how legit they actually are. Let's get this viral party started. Oh yeah. We got our ingredients here. We got our hot dogs. We got our pasta shells. The only ingredient that I don't see here is the adult diaper you're gonna need to wear after consuming this. Take your dog, put it in your shell. Now you wanna slide it in ever so gently. I just wanna apologize, Grandma. I am sorry that I am doing this to manicotti shells. So what we wanna do then is you wanna take your scissors here and you wanna cut off slabs of cheese. The only things that will survive nuclear Armageddon, cockroaches and Velveeta cheese. It actually smells worse than it looks if that's even possible. Pop this bad boy in the oven. Hope somehow this comes out looking more appetizing than it did going in. Hands down, the best peanut butter and jelly you'll ever eat. PB and J. I mean, who doesn't love a PB and J? Okay, so you want to punch a hole through the center of your PB&J here. They use the bottle cap. I'm just gonna use this here handy dandy shot glass. And then you wanna pinch the sides here so that you don't leak peanut butter and jelly into your oil. You got two ready to fry, people. Woo! Five, four, three, two, flip. Oh, look at that. Into the cinnamon and sugar. Wow. We're gonna get this a try. That's not good. That's legit. Oh yeah. This might be one of the best damn things I've ever eaten in my entire life. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've all been waiting for and the moment my toilet has been dreading. <laughs> that just looks terrible. I never thought I'd say this. If all I had left in the house was pasta, cheese, hot dogs, and milk, and my only other choice was like starving, I would do this. So for all those reasons, I'm gonna say, it's legit. Oh yeah. It's often said that when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. But when Lizzo gives you watermelon, you make mustard, watermelon, Huh? All right, I mean, this couldn't be more straightforward. You take watermelon, you take mustard. Um, we're gonna check it out, you ready? Here we go. Huh? It's the only reaction. This is just confusing, man, because it really is. It's like, you wanna be grossed out by it, but before you're grossed out by the taste of the mustard, the watermelon clears your mouth out and all you taste is watermelon. The most improbable come from behind victory. Ladies and gentlemen, watermelon and mustard. Oh yeah. It's legit. And that ladies and gentlemen brings us to the end of another edition of That's Legit. And when I wake up tomorrow, I will regret eating every one of them. Until next week, good night and sweet dreams. Guys, thanks for watching this video. If you like what you saw, make sure to give us a thumbs up and comment, because I love reading all your comments. And if you want more, subscribe right now.